this is Troy. So today I want to talk to you about our new report sync add-in for Excel. Now I will be making a longer video, um, more on the functionality the add-in. Today this is just going to be a very quick how to install and how to get up and running really quickly with it, okay? So first off, to install the new Excel report sync add-in, we're not going to install it within Excel we're actually or within stack we're actually going to install it within Excel so we can just drag Excel over here so the report sent add-in is going to work with Windows or Mac version of Excel 2016 or if you're running the um, Microsoft 365 online version of Excel so to install the add-in, we're going to go to Insert, and we're going to go to the Microsoft Store. Here it's going to give us a little search bar to be able to search for the search, and we're going to type in Stack Search. It'll be on the top of the list, and we're just going to click the little Add to add that plugin. It's going to report a little a Stack Report Sync right there in Excel, which is really cool. You can actually log into Stack and see all of your Stack projects right there within Excel, which is pretty cool. <clears throat> but more of a real case of how you would use this. Let me just kind of shrink that down. So here's a, a simple kind of bid form here. So I'm going to click on my little report sync icon. Let me make the screen a little bit bigger for you. The first time you use it, it is going to prompt you to log in with your, your stack username and password. And then after that, it's going to give you a list view or our agenda view of all the projects. So this will have every project through your lifetime. You can just show more results and just keep going and keep going and keep going. But all you do is just kind of like in stack, you're going to click on this to go into um, your project data. For the measurement side of the software, we have got your takeoff summary. For um, the pro side, for the materials, we have either your item cost by type report or your item cost by takeoff report. So we're just going to click on whichever report you want to go into. And then you're going to see all of your data right here. So uh, for example, how this works, you're going to go over into your Excel spreadsheet you're going to click on the cell that you want the data to go over into, okay? And then we're going to go over here and say I want to, I'm just dragging my mouse across. So use this to highlight all of these little fields. Hit this little plus sign. It's going to populate all that over here. And then all your existing formulas in your Excel spreadsheet would work. So I could say that, you know, add in my pricing, just work down the list and then Excel is going to work like you would expect it to. Boom, and just type in my pricing and then you're there you go. So it, this is a really awesome way to take your data from Stack and place it directly into uh, your existing Excel spreadsheet and place it exactly where you want to. So in this case, I, you know, I connected every, brought everything over, but you can control. So say that I only wanted to bring a single cell, I could. If I wanted to bring um, a, just a row, I could bring a row. If I wanted to bring this, I guess that was a column. If I wanted to bring this row, I could. So it's complete control. You can bring over your data exactly how you want it. Um, you're just gonna place it into your existing spreadsheet. Just click on where you want it to go. Choose what data you wanna come over. Hit the little plus sign and off you go. So that's your, your quick version. I will be making a longer, more in-depth version, but I very much so appreciate your time today. Thank you.